Uh, we're going to work on the bearings. I uh, noticed it the other day. This wheel right here. <clears throat> it's a little loose. So I got to turn it one. So what I'm going to do, I'm going to jack up the trailer and take the cotter pin off and uh, make it a little tighter because right now it's a little loose. But other than that, trailer's pretty good. And I started using this about what, eight months ago? Yeah. With the right def, you run the right def, you want to have that problem with the, uh, the engine light on your truck. You also stop using BIOS. It can be both of them or one of the two. Yeah, so, well, this this is definitely working for me. Yeah. And uh, I buy this at Costco. Yeah, but they sell it at other stores. No more engine light, guys. <laughs> I mean, I'm not, I'm not a diesel mechanic, but you got to kind of figure it out what works for your truck my my truck definitely didn't like the biodiesel or the cheap uh def so pay a little more money problem fix anyway the trailer's jacked up yeah once you get the trailer up just kind of inspect all three wheels just give it a little little turn being stubborn Wow, these are nice. Where'd you get these at? <laughs> I didn't mind you did. Oh man. So what I'm doing right now, I'm taking the cotter pin off. Uh, what I'm going to do, I'm going to turn this one to the next notch. Right. Right there. That's it. Looks good. So these are my brand new um, caps, see-through caps. So 
So these are made out of plastic. Uh, you, if you over tighten them, you break them. Just like that, barely, barely tighten it. And that's all you got to do, guys. Have any questions? <laughs> You're kind of quiet this morning. This is death. <laughs> It's a little yeah, early. Uh, we um, have a 9.30 appointment. It's 8.55, so we're here very early. Well, you know what? I don't have to be here early, but I know I got to fix some problem with the trailer or it, the truck. Anytime we have, we come to this place, so if he has any maintenance that he wants to get done, we arrive early and he takes care of that maintenance. And here are some of the simple tools that he carries with him. My channel locks, a hammer, my uh, wrench filter for the fuel, the oil, and then uh, my sockets. Oh, you got you, you got you guys got to have this right here. You guys yeah, get a flat important. tire. Don't call a service truck and and they make you wait two or three hours. Do it yourself. He also has his grease gun, some small straps that he might use on an occasion, and he has these rings. What he's doing is checking the brakes. He's turning the wheels with the, with the tires jacked up. He just had me turn it on, uh, turn it up to nine. One car, the one car is on the trailer. It was a very, well, it's only one car. <clears throat> so of course it was very, very quick. Now it does have um, pretty much a flat tire there and a low tire there, but that's how they gave it to us. 